let's score a football game using an Electromech control console. Before the game starts, clear the old scores by tapping New Game, then 1, then Enter on the control console. If you play 8 minute quarters, set the time showing on the scoreboard by tapping Set Clock, 8, 0, 0, Enter. The main timer counts down by default. Also by default, it shows minutes and seconds down to the final minute of a period. For the final 60 seconds, the timer shows seconds and tenths of seconds. You can turn this feature off by tapping 0.1 sec on off, then 0, then enter. To turn it back on, tap 0.1 sec on off, then 1, then enter. If this 10th second mode feature is enabled, you can use the set clock 0.1 sec button to edit or enter times less than 1 minute, including the 10th second digit. To start and stop the main timer, use the clock on off button. You can also use the pendant switch that plugs into the back of your control console. The second row of buttons on the control console allows you to work with different timers and settings which are not critical for understanding the basics of a football scoreboard during a game. The first meaningful thing, from the scorekeeper's perspective, which happens at the start of a football game is when one team takes possession of the ball. Use the pause button to toggle the possession indicators on the scoreboard between the guest and home teams. Let's say they are on the 32 yard line. Tap ball on, 3, 2, enter to show the stat on the scoreboard. Let's say the team gained 6 yards on their first play. Now it's second down with four yards to go. Tap the down plus one button to increment the down count. Tap yards to go, four, enter, to set your to go stat. You already know how to update the ball on stat. Now it's a little later in the game and congratulations, the home team just scored a touchdown. You can enter the new score directly with the set home score button or you can just tap home score plus one six times to add six points. It looks like the extra point kick was good, so you press home score plus one again. And, oh no, the ref says that there was a flag on the play. Well, you can edit that point away with the set home score button. Of course, the set guest score and guest score plus one buttons work the same way. Guest timeouts and home timeouts are like the plus one buttons, but they subtract one instead of adding it. At the end of the quarter, tap quarter period plus one to advance to the next quarter. You will need to manually reset the main timer to its start time before the ref calls time in. The horn is, by default, set to sound when the main timer reaches zero. You can also sound the horn manually by tapping the horn button. Your Electromech football control console has other features, including a practice segment timer mode that can help you keep your practices right on schedule. For a deeper dive into the capabilities of our controllers, take a look at the operator's manual which shipped with your system, or find it on our website, www.electro-mech.com. Thanks for keeping score with Electromech.